we're interested in my lab is to determine the structures and dynamics of molecules and we want to do so very accurately we want to do so with very high time resolution and also high sensitivity and what's also important is that we want to do that for very select molecules so that's the goal okay so take Alzheimer's disease for example this is a problem that's very difficult to study by NMR or x-ray crystallography because so many different conformations of these molecules exist at the same time um, so what we need in order to study that is a method where you can, you know, you have a lot of different conformations and you pick out a specific molecule and study the structure. And this is exactly what we do with our method, which is called I-mobility spectrometry mass spectrometry. So what we do in I-mobility mass spectrometry is to first measure the mass of the molecule. And then we can use this mass information to pick out a select molecule from a heterogeneous mixture of molecules and study that structure. So what we do in order to obtain structural information from a molecule is we inject this molecule into a drift cell and we fill this drift cell with a buffer gas, typically helium, and then we apply an electric field to this drift cell. And then we measure the arrival time, the time it takes for the ions to traverse this drift cell with the help of this electric field. And this arrival time tells us something about the collision cross-section of the molecule, and that collision cross-section tells us something about the structure, about the shape of the molecule. Because of the nature of our work, we're a very interdisciplinary group, and the, the type of work that we do ranges from building and using major scientific instrumentation um, to protein expression and purification, and to using computational chemistry methods to identifying structures of molecules.